beauty to you. You know my standing as qualified girl watcher. Just say she knocked me out. You made it? The living end. One look will convince you I fell in love and that's enough. Oh, and was awfully lucky. We had a eunuch at home. My brother had bought it for Tyus, but he hadn't delivered it yet. Well, Harmono, he's our slave, suggested a plan. I snapped it what up. What sort of a plan? The quieter you are, the quicker you learn. For me to trade clothes with the eunuch and go in his place. The eunuch's place? That's it. What kind of fun could you get out of that? Oh, really? Oh, the sight, the sound, the physical presence of a girl I was mad for? Is this a measly motive, Antifo? A shoddy stimulus? Tice was thrilled when they put me into her hands. She hustled me right in and put the girl into mine. Your hands? My hands. That's such a good idea. She spelled out my orders. No man was allowed to visit. I wasn't allowed to leave the women's quarters, compelled to stay by the girl at all times. I uh, lowered my eyes and nodded assent. Poor boy. I'm going out to lunch, she said. The girl just sits there, in the middle of all this bustle, inspecting a picture on the wall. A famous subject, Jupiter launching a shower of gold into Denny's lap. I began to inspect it myself. It repaid attention, encouraging me. It was a god long ago, who played almost the same game. Disguised himself as a man, snuck under another's room, right down the chimney, and seduced a woman. <laughs> and not just any god, but the king of gods himself, the one who rules everything. I might be only human, but couldn't I do the same? And so I decided to do it. <clears throat> During my internal debate, they put the girl in bed. I stood there, waiting for orders. Hey, eunuch, says one of them coming up. You take this fan and refresh her while we go take our baths. <laughs> I grumble a little, but I take the fan. I like to have been there seeing you. A great big donkey like you. <laughs> the words went out of their mouth, but they ran out of the room. Off to the bath with the whoop, when the cat's away and all that. Meantime, the girl fell asleep. I took a sideways peek through the fan like this and a careful look around. The coast was clear. I locked the door. Then what? Then what, you moron? Oh! A chance like this, no matter how short, do you think I'd miss it? Temptation, aspiration, surprise and passion all mixed in one. Just what do you think I am? A eunuch? <laughs> 